Hello, it's Bob from Dead on Board Gaming. Thanks for joining me today. Uh, today I am going to open a box of Next Adventure. Um, and it's I got a good discount on it, obviously, because uh, somebody at least stole the box top. So we're going to check this out and see what we get. I guess I'll just use their rip instead of having to try to figure out how to rip it somewhere else, I guess. Huh? So yeah, that started for me. So, it looks like all the packs are still there, so it looks like it is just the box topper that they got. So, let's see how it is. I believe soon we are going to actually try to get this, get a video of this game in, because I really want to learn how to play. I got all these cards to play with, and I really love the artwork. Uh, but the game seems to be pretty popular. It's been around for a couple years now, so obviously it's got some legs. All right, and we got a rail, rare Betamon and a super rare Kazukimon. So, first one hit already, and I love that. I like the green coming in up here at the top, so really like that one. He looks cool. <clears throat> All right. Rolling here. I'm gonna, I'll probably leaf through a couple of these and if I see anything cool, probably stop, but I'm gonna only call out the rares. Evolution Ancient and Dino Rexmon. He's pretty sweet looking. Their foiling makes everything just look very fancy. I think everything's a, a super rare now because of the shiny. It's a pretty sweet one. Ancient Cosmon. And... Seraphmon promo card. That's a pretty cool one. So, let's slide that one in there. That's a nice little pool, I hope. I mean, it looks cool as shit. Look at the, uh, it looks like the, almost like a cold foiling gold there. So, uh, instead of the regular gold band there. It's pretty cool. I like it. And he's got the little leprechaun kid by him. Wendigo Mon. That's awesome. I think... By far, like, most of the time when I see stuff and I, I like it, it's usually purple. Like, the purple stuff just really sticks out to me. Got a weird roller mark there, it looks like, but... Ancient Sphinx Mon, that is awesome. I love Egyptian style art as well, so that's kind of a, a double thing here for me. I like that one. And a Mega Gar... Garuramon. Super rare. That's a pretty cool looking one. So far, I feel like there's. Uh, I mean, everything seems pretty cool, so. Uh, I think they really just got that box topper. Hope they found what they were looking for if they needed it that bad, since it's just the box topper. Skull Nightmon and Emperor Greymon. And I feel like this box is very top heavy. <clears throat> Alright. It's strange. 
my allergies are killing me again, so I will try to stop, or try to avoid clearing as much as possible, but bear with me, guys. It's, I'm allergic to this whole season. Stravimon. And Ancient Cosmon. Shelmon. Oh, I thought he was a turtle. He's living in a crab shell, though. Sister Mon Blanc. Awakened. And Ancient Beetle Mon. Oh wow, that that's not even a super rare. I thought that was a super rare. They're so close now. Uh, I think it's like an altered art or an extended art, though. It, it does cover the edge of the borders there. Another Sister Mont Blanc awakened. And, uh, looks like a promo Rosemon with a cowgirl. These promos are cool, though. There's, like, there's little circular, like, they almost look textured. It's pretty cool. So cool looking. King Waymon. Chaos Dreamon. And Strabimon. Koji Minamoto and Dark Nightmon. Kochi Kimura and Zoe Orimoto. Getting some trainers here. I don't feel like I got any of them, and then I got three out of the last four rares. <clears throat> Dino Rexmon and Ware Garuramon. Tommy Hemi and Razinmon. All right. Coda Demoto. Oh, and the secret rare is Lucimon Chaos Mode. Oh, that's cool. So cool. Okay. 
Kochi Kimiro, and Cherubimon. He looks badass. J.P. Shibayama and Skull Knight Mountain. Alright, we got Ancient Beetle Mountain and Dorumon. Wow. I feel like that's some kind of an alternate art or a campaign rare or something because look at that. That's so cool looking. I'm going to put that one into a sleeve just to be safe. Ancient Megatheriumon and Takiu Kanbara. I am probably butchering all of these. Dead or Alive and Kodo Dorimon, look at that. That silver cross there is awesome. Looks so good. Actually, it almost looks like a D-pad, actually, not a cross. Now that I look at it some more, it's more of a D-pad than a, than a cross. Feel like it's supposed to be a digital shield. Dory Greymon looks pretty cool. Betamon and Sister Seal Awakened. Yeah, that's a different Sister Mon, I feel like. I feel like there's been Sister Mon in all of the sets, so I wonder if you can make a sweet Sister Mon deck yet. Strabumon and Vikemon promo. He's sweet looking, and I do like the way that they got his eyes in there so that, like, his body's not, but... It all almost looks like these things are 3D because of the way they do it. Like, the picture just jumps off of it. Alright, couple left here. Oh, we got... Chaos Dreamon and Metal Guru Ramon, also uh, the promo art. That is so cool. These promo, like I love the little circles and everything over here. And then the way that the background does that, it like it looks almost like a 3D card. Definitely an awesome touch to put on to a card game. JP and Metal Cannon. Alright, last pack. Let's see if we got anything crazy left in here. Or if we've already cashed everything out. Dino Rexmon. And Ancient Megatherium Mon. Oh, 
room on. All right. Well, thank you guys for joining me. Hope you guys enjoyed. And like, subscribe, and share if you did. Thank you and have a great one.